I'm about to share some information with you that's going to be shocking. It's going to contradict what you've been told and what you've heard all of your life. And you know what that is? Jesus is not white. This depiction of Jesus was painted by this man. His name was Warner Solomon. His parents immigrated here from Sweden and Finland. So quite naturally, he was going to paint Jesus from a European perspective, but it is a false depiction of Jesus. And why does that matter? Why is it important that Jesus is accurately depicted as the Palestinian Jew that he was? Well, there are three reasons. Number one, falsely portraying Jesus as European identifies him with the oppressor. Yeah, that's right. I can remember as a teenager growing up, when I saw those pictures of Jesus on church walls and in the homes of a lot of African-Americans, I thought to myself, how or why would I serve this Jesus when he looks just like the people who are oppressing and segregating my people? That made no sense to me. And as a result, I rejected Jesus well into my 20s. But there's another reason. Falsely portraying Jesus as European promotes white supremacy. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's, yeah, right. that's right. Because again, it says white people look just like the Lord, just like God. So quite naturally, they are the superior people. So in my mind, I said, no, I am not about following a religion or a person who's promoting white supremacy. But there's a third reason, and that is falsely portraying Jesus as European alienates people of color. It's facts! It's facts! It's in our facts! These facts are in our facts! It's in our facts! Just like I said, as a teenager, when I saw those pictures of Jesus and he looked just like the oppressor, he looked just like white supremacists. As a person of color, that alienated me. And I hear that all the time. When I'm sharing Jesus with African-Americans, especially African-American men, oftentimes I hear, I am not serving a white God. Not gonna do it, wouldn't be prudent at this juncture. Or I hear, the Bible is written by the white man for the white man. So this false picture of Jesus has alienated so many people of color. And again, it is a false depiction. Jesus was a Palestinian Jew in the flesh. And those people are not European. They do not have blue eyes and straight hair. A group of researchers and scientists researched what Jesus probably looked like, and they came up with a completely different image of who Jesus is. And they said that he probably looked more like this. This is not a picture of Jesus but it is probably an image that looks more like Jesus. And when I look at this image, I can identify with this image. And keep in mind, Jesus was a minority. The Jewish people at that time were subject to Roman rule. Jesus was unfairly tried and executed, basically murdered. He came from a family who descended from slavery. So there is a lot of commonalities between the Jewish people and black and especially African-American. But portraying him as a European undermine those commonalities. So, black man. Wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up, wake, wake, wake up out of your sleep, wake up. Jesus is not white. And again, this is probably a more accurate depiction of who Jesus is. 
So if you've been alienated, if you have felt like you can't identify with Jesus because of those false depictions, I hope this helps you. Because the greatest decision that you can ever make, and definitely the greatest decision that I ever made, was becoming a dedicated, committed Christ follower. So again, I hope this helps.